What's going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Michael and welcome to Fudge Muppet. Today we're entering the Commonwealth with some Fallout 4 and examining some of the best legendary weapon effects in the game. The 5 best legendary effects to be exact. Before we get into it, I do want to say that some legendary effects are only amazing on one certain weapon, so we didn't include them. Also, some legendary effects sound good, like 2 shot, but actually work on base damage and aren't as effective as you're led to believe. 2 shot also increases recoil and reduces accuracy, there's heaps we've had to consider. And because different legendary effects are good at different things, these effects aren't in any particular order. With that said, let's get into it. Let's begin with a bang. Without a doubt, one of the best legendary weapon effects in the game is the explosive effect. This causes 15 points of explosive damage against targets. And while this may not sound like a huge bonus, it is, for a few reasons. The first reason is that this can actually be increased with all ranks of Demolition Expert and the explosive's bobblehead to cause 32.25 points of extra explosive damage. The second reason is that you will actually cause area damage with this weapon, meaning that you can spray it around to kill multiple multiple enemies at once. This also works with the third rank of Demolition Expert, which increases the area of explosive damage. That's why it works so well on one of the best guns in the game, which you can buy, Spray and Pray. It also works well on other automatic weapons, like the minigun, which effectively causes its damage output to triple. Shotguns also benefit heaps, because each pellet gets more damage. Let us not forget that explosive damage also has a tendency to cripple limbs. So as you spray it around, you will completely destroy all who oppose you, while while also turning them into flying chunks, which is an added bonus that makes it fun and effective. Next up, we've got Vats Enhanced. This legendary weapon effect deserves way more attention than people give it. So obviously this effect is only good for characters who are using Vats, but what does it do? Well, it actually differs depending on the weapon type. On ranged weapons, it improves your Vats hit chance, which is nice, but most importantly, it makes each shot cost 25% less action points to use. This means that you can take a weapon like a pistol and let loose two or three more shots in Vats. They'll be more accurate shots too. It's pretty neat, but it's not the best. The real advantage here is for melee weapons. The Vats Enhanced Legendary Effect makes action point cost 40% less, and features on the infamous Rockville Slugger Legendary Baseball Bat. This works a charm for high agility blitz melee characters, as you can zip around the battlefield, essentially teleporting constantly to each target, smashing heads off almost twice as much. You seriously have to try this one out for yourself, even just use the console commands to make our Fallout 4 Swatter build if you're curious. It feels seamless and unstoppable, and it is. The third legendary weapon effect on this list is staggering. This beastly legendary effect gives you a chance to stagger your enemies when you hit them. This isn't the best on slow weapons, but on automatic weapons, it's incredibly overpowered. Take any rapidly firing machine gun and you'll be able to shoot targets non-stop, as they struggle to shoot back due to staggering. This is best against big tough enemies though, as other enemies might just die first anyway. The stagger chance is also increased by people using automatic weapons by more than just the fact that they shoot more bullets. If you're using automatics, you'll also have invested in the commando perk, which increases chance to stagger at ranks 4 and 5. This all stacks to make one glorious weapon which stops enemies in their tracks, but that's not even the best application. The best way to use this legendary effect is on a ripper, and you can find a staggering ripper known as the harvester in the Far Harbor DLC. We have a guide on it which you can search up if you want to know where to get it. Because the ripper spins so fast, it works like an automatic melee weapon and essentially staggers the enemy non-stop. It's crazy stuff, so you can see why it gets a place in the video. Bleeding damage is phenomenal, so you probably knew that the Wounding Legendary Effect would be on this list. The Wounding Legendary Effect adds 25 points of bleeding damage over a few seconds to each attack you land. It's cool on melee weapons like Pikmin's Blade, which is a small fast dagger that can be used to hit enemies quickly in succession, and it would be beast on a Ripper too, which lands mini hits non-stop. Where it shines really bright though, in my opinion, is on automatic weapons, on machine pistols and miniguns, all of that good stuff that worked well with the staggering effect. Bleeding damage, however, is thought by many people to be inferior to other types of damage because it takes a few seconds to fully affect the enemy. What people don't know, however, is the secret behind bleeding damage. Bleeding damage surpasses all resistances, and plenty of enemies are actually really hard to kill due to their resistances, not actually their health. Try it out for yourself and watch the bleeding damage stack as you let out 20 bullets from your rifle in a few seconds. Not only does the effect stack 
stack well and ignore resistances, but it also works like the explosive effect in the sense that it will be applied to each projectile if you're using a shotgun or scatter-based energy weapon. This is probably the best legendary weapon effect in all of Fallout 4, as you likely determined for yourself from the gameplay. Finally, we have legendary weapon effect number 5, Furious. Furious weapons do more damage on each consecutive hit on the same target. This makes it sensational against tanks and can make seemingly weak weapons able to kill any kind of massive enemy if you've got the ammo. What it does is add 15% extra damage per hit, and you can stack this up about 10 times to cause ridiculous damage output on the one foe. Like many legendary weapon effects, this works well on things that can strike faster, such as the Ripper for melee and automatic rifles for ranged attacks. You can easily get an automatic weapon that does 100 damage and just take it up to 300 damage really fast and dish those numbers out against one big enemy until they die. Remember the 15% compounds the damage over time, so 100 would go to 115, but then you'd take 15% of 115 and add it and so on. There's a weapon in game called the Furious Power Fist which you can get at Swan's Pond that has this effect, and we recommend using this weapon for unarmed builds like our Gladiator build. It's also great on the Plasma Thrower, and overall the Furious Furious Effect's effectiveness ensures it a spot on this list, and likely a spot in your arsenal. Subscribe to Fudge Muppet for more videos like this. We really love to make them, and if you love to watch them, let us know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching it this far. It goes a long way that you do, and please hit like if you wish to show any further support. Social media links are in the description. My name is Michael, and I'll nerd out with you again very soon.